Little Smart Kids. Subscribe to our channel and you'll never miss any new cartoons. And make sure to like it. Everything is fine, boss. All according to the plan. We're going to arrive soon. Get into our trap? It can't be the other way. She is his best friend. We also left a lot of tips for him. He should take the bait. <laughs> oh yeah, it was easy with the footprints. Oh yeah, and how do you like the idea with the cones? It's not hard to notice them. <laughs> and of course the branch. I think that he'll understand everything quickly and be in a hurry to rescue Emmy. <laughs> Hello, my friends. I'm coming to Emmy's house. We agreed to meet today. However, I was phoning her all morning, but there was no answer. I'm going to find out what's going on. It's strange. The footprint is still fresh. It reminds me of something. Hmm, but what exactly? The garage is open, but the car is still inside. I feel like something bad has happened here. Oh no! These footprints aren't from Emmy's boots for sure. It's obvious that they are a man's footprints, and there is dirt on them. What has happened here? Cones? A pine branch? Footprints on the ground, man's footprints from the boots, cones, and a pine branch. Aha! I understand what's happened here. This is Handy Andy. I really need your help. Emmy was kidnapped. She was kidnapped? What do you mean she was kidnapped? They took her to the forest. Yes, now I'm going to wait for you near the forest. Hurry up, please. Faster. We need to rescue Emmy. We can't waste a minute. Oh yes, the footprints told me a lot. First, the footprint of the wheels. It can tell us about the car that left the footprint. It can be a car or, as we have here, the truck. Then the footprint from the boots. We can check the length and identify if it was left by a man or a woman. So, I figured out that the footprint on the ground was from the truck, and men were in Emmy's house. Because the footprint from the boots belonged to a man for sure. The cone and the branch are from the forest, I'm sure. That's why I think the kidnappers came from the forest, and they have their shelter there. There was the same footprint from the truck near Emmy's house. It means that we are going the right way, sir. Look, it's Emmy's shoe. I saw the second one under her chest of drawers. Okay, so we're going to look for Emmy in the forest. The first, the first. Hi, speaking. The first, we have an urgent call. The alarm went off again in the city money store. Again? It's clear. I'm going to send someone to check. Go to the city money storage. Check everything there. The alarm went off again. I think it's a problem with the security system. I've got your message coming.
Let's go, Handy Andy. We need to find Emmy. Let's go faster. We are almost there. Surround the object. We need to block all the exits. It's the police. You are surrounded. Go outside one by one with your hands up. Repeat, you are surrounded. I can't just stay here and wait. Emmy is there. I'm going inside. Andy, Andy, don't do it. There can be a trap in there. Are you okay? I worried so much. Andy, Andy, everything was planned here. They did it on purpose to distract you and the police. They planned all the details carefully. What? What are you talking about, Emmy? They trapped you here. Their plan is very tricky. They organized a big robbery. I don't really know the details. So I think they managed to do everything they planned. If you are here now... <laughs> Emmy, calm down. Everything is fine. We managed to find you. That's the most important thing now. Just could not be true, Handy Andy. They tricked us again. <laughs> is gold here? Yes, boss. The gold is in a safe place. Hmm. Do you know what you have to do next? And one more. Without a surprise here, is it clear? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, do it! Wow, wow, like a real racer. Hello. How do you like my two-wheel pretty thing? Breathtaking, Emmy. You have good taste. Yeah, if you want, you can go around a bit on it. But a bit, only one circle. I didn't get to enjoy it fully yet. Thanks a lot for the offer, but... Here we go. How about this? Wow, cool. I'd like to offer the race then. Let's check what these Iron Beauties can do. Let's go, Andy Andy, go! Come on! Come on, Andy Andy, follow me. Why are you going so slow? <laughs> uh, these girls. Hold on, Emmy. Wait a second and I'll show you how to ride. Now what? You've got it. Don't relax yet. I'm going to be the first anyway. <laughs> Come on, go! <laughs> are just as fast. Let's go! <laughs> Emmy, wait! Don't go so fast! Don't be in such a hurry! Wait! Wait for me!
Tammy, stop! Wait! This racer reminds me of someone! Who can he remind you of? <sighs> You're boring, Handy Andy. This is a race, but you keep repeating stop, stop! I'm not a little girl. I can go wherever I want to. Not a little girl? Now look, who did you chase? Oh no, no, no. It's impossible. I don't believe it. It's just impossible. They, they kidnapped me, tied me up, and locked me in an abandoned hut in the forest. <laughs> yeah, it's Razor and Rocco. We need to hide and call the police fast. Speaking. Officer, we need your help. Come to the old car dump immediately. Razor and Rocco are here. Ugh, they're leaving. We can't lose them. Let's chase them, Emmy. Be careful, Handy Andy. We're coming. We cannot allow them to notice us, otherwise everything is going to fail. They can escape again. Is anybody following us, Rocco? No, everything's clear. Go faster. We need to dock a boat closer. It's far away now. All right, let's go then. Okay, don't you worry. Nothing's going to happen with the gold. There is nobody in the harbor. Give up, guys. This is the end. Let's run away, Rocco. We need to rescue ourselves faster. The boss is gonna kill us. The gold is in the truck. Don't worry about the gold. Let's go. At least we will take the stolen gold back to the storage. Ugh, they managed to escape again. But it's okay. One day I'll catch you. That's for sure. Catch you. We need to meet urgently. I think I found a treasure map. Yeah? Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. What news? Okay, Emmy, let's do it. Urgently, I think I found a treasure map. This is great. These treasure hunters will take us to where we need to go, and everything will be there as we need. <laughs> <laughs> So 
So now, Handy Andy, we take 20 steps to the north. I'm going to use the compass to find out the right way to go. I've got the compass. It helps people to find the right direction to go. It identifies the sides of the world. Its magnetic needle focuses to the Earth's magnetic field. It's going to show us now where the north is, and we will follow it. Here we go. North is there. It means that south is in the opposite way. East is on the right, and west on the left. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Emmy, we're at the right place. Here is the rock. Here is the door. But how are we going to open it? Hmm, it's not going to be so easy. The door is very heavy. I'm thinking, Handy Andy. Think, I saw this picture somewhere. Wow, my grandmother gave me this medallion a long time ago. She told me to keep it, watch it like she did, and her mother did before. Maybe he can help us open the door to the cave. Let's go faster. Follow them while the door is open. Wow, wow, what a treasure, Emmy. Yeah, Handy Andy. I still cannot believe that we managed to find it. There's a red ruby in the middle. Unbelievably beautiful stone. My grandmother used to tell me about it. It has a magic power. It's a very unusual stone. What is this, Handy Andy? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the treasure, guys. Now we can deal with it ourselves. But first, we'll cope with you. Catch them, Rocco. Hurry up, Emmy! Fast to the exit! Everything is going to be under the stones here soon. Razor, we have to get out of here as fast as possible. What? What about the treasure? Take a look at it, there's so much! I don't care about the treasure! We need to get rid of this! Come on, Razor! We're late, Razor. It seems that we're in a trap. Don't panic. We're going to do something. <sighs> Rocco, I think there's one more exit here. Come on. What about Razor and Rocco? There's a stone wall in the cave now. Oh. Don't worry about them. They'll be all right. These bandits will find the exit for sure. It's a pity that the exit is blocked by the stones. There are so many treasures in the cave. Wow! When did you manage? Good job! 
It's only sleight of hand, Emmy. This is for you. It's the very same ruby. It's so beautiful. Thank you so much, Handy Andy. Oh, thank goodness at last. I thought I wouldn't come out. We're very lucky to get out of there. I thought we were going to stay in there forever. We were almost crushed with stones. Andy Andy won this time, but it's okay. We're going to have our revenge, and it'll be very soon. <laughs> <laughs> One hour before that. Hmm. Andy, Andy, and Emmy decided to present an ancient stone, which they found in the cave, to the city museum. It's a great idea. So do you understand everything? It's going to be last chance. Don't lose it. Everything will be perfect, boss. Quiet, Rocco. We're not just walking in the park. I didn't do it on purpose. The cat ran into my feet. How do you know the code? No time for talking now. Come on, faster. What are we going to do with infrared rays? We're going to hack the security system now and turn off the rays. This device will help us to hack the security system of the museum. Now it's going to identify the code of the system and then turn it off. Here we go. It took just a few seconds and we did it. Take the ruby and let's go. Come on, faster. What is this, Razor? Faster, run away from here. The stone, don't forget the stone. All cars. There was a robbery at the city museum. An ancient stone was stolen. The orange truck must be blocked immediately. Faster! Faster! They're following us! Faster! This is the most this old truck can do. Order to stop immediately! Give up! Don't listen to him! Press the gas! We're not going to give up! Get ready! They're going to leave the tunnel now! Hold on! Oh! Away. They broke the blockade! Hold the steering wheel! Rocco, listen to me! Uh, ah, no! Now that's it for sure! The police are going to deal with you now. That is the end. Yeah, Rocka, we've lost today. The boss is gonna kill us. 
Calling the first. Hello? We have received an urgent call about the robbery. The address is 10 James Street. Can you go there and check out what's going on? All the other officers are busy now. It's exactly on your way. Okay, I got your message. I'll have to stop at James Street to find out what's happened there. These bandits can wait. They're already in handcuffs and behind bars. They can't escape. And then I'm going to take them to the police station. Here's James Street, but where's number 10? I don't understand. Thanks for rescuing us, buddy. We will not forget it. Don't mention it. The police deserve it. They drive around and think that they're the owners of this city. <laughs> um, sure, I mean, we've gotten a lot of trouble from the police. Okay, we're wasting our time. They're going to chase us soon. We need to hurry to the harbor. Shh, be quiet. The police officer can hear us. Go, fast. <laughs> Hello, my friends. I've had a lot of things to do for the last couple of days. Now I'm going to the car shop. I want to buy new tires for my lovely Ford Mustang. At last, I can do it today. One more block and I'll be there. Stop! Why is this police car turned? Something is wrong here. I'll get a little closer and find out. Maybe they need some help. Ugh, what's happened here? Is it a car accident or what? Where are you going going? The police officer's tied up. What's going on? Thank you, Handy Andy. It seems that you're around when help is always needed. They've escaped! Can you imagine? Who escaped? What happened? I was driving those loud music lovers to the police station. However, suddenly that bus appeared from thin air and crashed into my car. One minute, and those bandits tied me up and escaped on that bus. Oh no! Where can we find them now? Did you see the license plate of the bus? Can you describe it? Sure I can. I heard that they were talking about going to the harbor, so we have to go there fast. We just need to turn my car back. Will you help me, Handy Andy? I will. You don't need to ask. More. 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 Here we go. Done. Okay. Now let's go straight to the harbor. I'm going to need some help on the way there. Andy, Andy, I see it. We're following it. Good news, Mr. Officer. Keep chasing them. Why are they going to the harbor? I don't like it. Something is wrong. 
We have the police following us. They managed to find us. Press the gas pedal. We need to reach the harbor at any cost. We have to hurry. We're almost there. Andy, Andy, they've noticed us. We have to catch them before they reach the harbor. We don't know what's there waiting for us. We will catch them. They will not escape. Hey, give me the road, bulldozer. Go away. Get away from here fast. We're chasing bandits here. <laughs> <laughs> Give us the road! You're stopping us from chasing these serious bandits! I repeat, give us the road! Just a minute, guys. I'll try to do it faster. Come on! We cannot waste even a minute! Faster! We missed them, Handy Andy! Now we have to look for them in the harbor! I'll call for help from the air! We will have to! The bulldozer messed everything up! Where are they? Seems like they fell down through the ground. I don't understand. Where could they go? <gasps> Andy Andy, look! The submarine! That's why they were hurrying to the harbor. Now everything is clear. They have decided to escape in a submarine. I see the submarine. It's starting to go under the water. What should we do? Recall. We missed them. I repeat, recall. Go back to the station. <laughs> it's not our day today, Handy Andy. They've managed to escape. Uh, we have lost today, but it's only for today. <laughs>